Hey folks, welcome to another episode of Ghostbusters. And we'll see how... What the... What? Wait a minute, what's over here? Anything? Wrong way. What the hell is that? What is that music? Charged with a high level of PK energy as well as a strange sense of mischievous mischievousness, this ordinary looking traffic cone has been known to maliciously change position, confusing drivers and writing up an impressive stream of bizarre traffic accidents. Huh. Wow, that's nine ninety four hundred now. Ah, right. uh, great. Hindenburg, the opera. Wasn't that show shut down when the stage caught fire and killed the cast? I just had to repeat you. Oh, you fucking asshole. That's right. Ruthless producer. He just reopened it last week. It's crackling. There must be something really bad about this place. Grab a full scan. Good idea. You should probably have a look around. Guess that means we're not alone. Yep. These are some unusual flux patterns. Whoa, wait. Don't touch that. That's what I thought. Black slime. Black slime is a hazardous form of ectoplasmic residue. Toxic to both body and soul. Very dangerous. Egon and I haven't developed clothes and boots sufficient enough to insulate against the negative psychokinetic effects of this stuff yet, so be careful. In other words, the stains don't ever come out. Ooh. Watch yourself! What the fuck? No! Stop! Don't be singing! Okay. Looks like an opera singer. I'm not. And I have to be one of that. Peter, you better take her. What is that supposed to be? I'm a chubby chaser. You take out one, both the wrong. I'm going to go. Look out above you. Come on, Winston. Not trying to. Shit. Look out above you. More trouble. Where are you? I actually like this. Uh, I don't have time for you right now, Carboyle. God damn it. Try to get to the fucking thing, man. 
Shit. Whoa, I can't, I don't, I can't. I can't see, I can't be out of the way. What the fuck? God, pit. Hey, over here. On the right. Hey, over here. Oh, what the hell? Really? Is going on now? God damn. Oh, I didn't know how to get that. Fuck yeah. Where, where is it? Oh, come on. Where? where? Yeah. You can do one. Run! Can't. Every fucking thing in the goddamn way. What? Can't fucking look out above you. That's it. Oh, my. I don't even know what the hell's going on anymore. I can't, I can't talk anymore. The chaos. Where's the other fucking thing? Look out above you. What do you mean above me? We just did a service to humanity, kid. In the murder of the pearl. Let's go. Damn. I Fuck. swear, most urban renewal, all shiny and clean. I love it. Oh, great. Now what? Say, is that you? It's hard to miss. <laughs> yeah. How close do we have to get the big trap to reel them in? A lot closer than this. Great. Let's see if it's here. He's looking for something. Is he looking for something or someone? Only 
when you ask, I'm going to stay here. If you can see behind me, the streets are in absolute chaos. Authorities are doing everything they can to quell the panic and maintain order. It is madness out here. The Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, star of the popular children's television show, is on a rampage. This is not the Stay Puft we've come to love. Fortunately, the Ghostbusters have arrived to put everything back to normal. You say so. It's damaged. I've got to fix it or we won't stand a chance. We need to get from here to there. Make sure the big boy doesn't find whatever he's looking for. Good strategy. It's dangerous, though. That's a lot of open ground to cover. All right, sport. Looks like it's really new. Let's go across Times Square and get into the building. Stay on the door. You guys keep him off us if you think you can. He knows you're there, Ray. I don't think he likes yeah, it. Yeah, he spotted us. Keep moving. I can't, I can't fucking move. Keep away from those feet. He'll stop you with the jelly. Pepper him with bows on darts. What the fuck? Nice bows on. That really big him. Great job. Now see if he wants score. Get it? I'm funny for you, know. Fucking bastards. Oh shit. Here he comes. You may have been over. Stick close to me and as far away from him as you can. Where the hell did. Beckman, you've got to distract him. Beckman, are you getting coffee? Beckman's getting coffee. Pepper him with bows on darts. What do you think I'm doing? Hopefully, quick. Draw him over here. Oh, because, yeah, you know what the hell you're doing, right? What was that? Loosen him up. Shit. What? Shit. There were only five production models that Telepro's red phone ever made. It's rumored that the phone only completed calls for those about to die. Yeah, like me. Fuck. Do I have time to fucking think? Barely any time to think. Shit. Immunity. All right. God, doesn't give you a breather, does it? Shit. All full. Going up. He uh, just passed gas. Set for it. Relax, sir. We have a foul vapors all the time. Let's stay in for lunch, you said. I leave the building, you said. It'll be quiet, you said. You know you're fine. You're right. 
I secretly knew our lives would be in danger and thought, hey, I'll make sure I trap Mark with me inside an elevator! You two need to go fuck now. You need to go kiss and make up and fuck each other. Stay with me, Haas. I'm sure there's more fun up ahead. Yeah. Oh, I missed them. Huh? What am I stuck on now? Get the fuck out of my face! You think Ray? I'm away. Where is what are you, Ray? Get this shit out of my face. God damn all this fucking shit in the fucking way, man. There's 50 fucking things in the way. I can't get through the goddamn thing. I cannot get through the fucking stupid ass fucking desk and fucking this desk and then that fucking chair. Jesus Christ, get out of my fucking way. Christ. Moves like he's got an 800 pound fucking gorilla. I'm sure there's more fun up ahead. Fuck you. Huh? We stirred up a hornet's nest, kid. God. Why does it say purchase? What upgrade am I purchasing? What? 5,000. There's... The PTE meter, there's a fast trap, which is. does nothing. Gives you the creeps, huh? Get this shit out of the way. 
Fuck all this shit. Oh, come on, man. What the shit I weigh? Jesus Christ. This is fucking stupid. This is fucking dumb. God damn it, man. Ray goes down like a fucking bitch. God, Ray goes down like a fucking pussy. Three goddamn things. Everything's in my fucking way, so I can't get out of the goddamn way. Stay with me, Hoss. I'm sure there's more fun up ahead. Look at this. This fucking door. Oh, in my me. fucking way. Huh? Oh my god. So fucking stupid. Sudden movements. Okay, sure got quiet all of a sudden. Now it is. Fucking model. John George Holman commissioned a steel model for Domestic Center of Evil, Black Low Rise of Tri, on the Shandor Architectural Firm. The model was completed, but Holman never returned the claim or pay for it. Okay. Does that give me any money for anything? No. Want to get that? Okay, so. Get the shit out of the way. Is going off. See all this shit in the way. That's why you have all this crap in here. So you can't fucking move. He's 
right by you, Ray. Come on. What the fuck? Someone needs a ghost monster. Yeah, can you face the right fucking way? What the fuck are you doing? Madman of the Hague. I am the Hague. Remco de Groot. Great, I am Groot. De Groot was infamous for supposedly using his own blood and the blood of others to construct his modernist masterpieces. It was later proven just a wild rumor, however. <sighs> Sorry about that, folks. <laughs> Removes movement restrictions. Want to get that one? All right, time. No! Somebody help me! Easy now, miss. Just relax. No sudden movements. Perfectly safe now. Sudden movements! Sudden movements! What the? Yeah, I'm wow, trying to... check it out, kid. What a view, huh? Manhattan. I love it. Well, I was trying to get that fucking thing, but... Uh... <laughs> You're just lucky to have met someone as special as me. <sighs> it's okay, Dr. Benedict. You're fine. You didn't spill your coffee, did you, Peter? Ray, I got coffee for all of us. But the little monsters spilled it. And what's the story with those things, anyway? What? Was that a manifestation of ghosts? Uh, yeah, probably. It just made me. <laughs> Would you like to take the most direct route out of here, or the scenic route to its latest choice? There's a stairwell over here. Let's go. Yeah, Grace under pressure. I appreciate that, in a lady. Okay, Slugger, let's you and me do this quick and quiet before Tubby Soft Squeeze out there figures out what we're up to. I think Tubby Soft Squeeze has dog ears, Ray. We go up then, to the roof. Wait a minute, what the hell's down here? Anything? Shit. All right, all right, I'll go up, I'll go up, I'll go up, I'll go up. Ah! What the? Stay tough, spotted us. Move, move. Not much longer, Cadet. I'm going up. What do you think I'm doing? That way. 
Oh, that's... Come on, let's go. Oh. Who the hell is this guy? Our construction worker grows great. Brave souls that since the evolution of the man, Skyliner met their fates in terrible accidents. They've fallen from great heights, been crushed by swinging steel, drowned in vats of setting country, and stolen by half pitch. City spell on the bones of these victims of on the job construction accidents. Now they've all found new careers in deconstruction. <laughs> Where the hell? Hey, come here, we're out. Yo, a little help. Dealing with them. Take it apart. Shit. Like that. Um, is the thing going to... Hold on. I swear I'm on that fucking trap. Tell one thing, it does make you seem like you did some work. Don't come easy. Side of the three-story building, and you had to climb all the way back up to the 
in the town one part. How, how mad would you be if those three of Thank you. I'd go with Mighty Fist. Uh, okay, and throw in sugar. That giant blue and white toy man thing, or whatever, is still coming. It's climbing the building. Thank you, Miss Exposition. I'm impressed with his agility, considering it's completely my performance. Who knows? We got the Super Slammer back on Pulse and Echo on his rolling. We're repositioning now. Can you hold the same up there for a few minutes? If by few you mean less than one, then sure, we can do that. <laughs> hey, did somebody tell you it was break down? No sweat, kid. We've got you. The larger town. Did you see if you could knock off Mr. Sweet? Yeah, you mind helping me, you fucking asshole? Holy shit. All right, there, sunshine. Are you okay? You're all strapped in. We've got a good tight grip on your belt. Here he comes. The big daddy manifestation himself. A raging blob of densely packed marshmallow. Oh, boy. Melt him, Chief. Give him full screen. He's right, rookie. Your health insurance doesn't begin for another 89 days. More of those minis. How many can he generate? Probably 200,000 square feet of solid marshmallow. That's 60. What the fuck? Hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. I think I'm doing, asshole. I'm fucking in now. Hit him with bulls on darts. Is that his upset look? What do you think? What do you think I'm doing? See him a fucking lullaby? Jerking him off with fucking... Some s'mores? Using some chocolate syrup to suck them off? Shit. You got him on the road, Blaster! Clap the last one so we can go home! You know, you could help me. How about you shoot some of these fucking guys? What do you think I'm doing? Shit. You kill my dessert! Scoreboard reads Ghostbusters 2! Gozer the Gozerian Zero! Looking like a real big leaguer out there, champ! Ray, Peter, we're in position. The trap is set. We're prepared to capture Stay Pup. Where is he? He's that white puddle you're driving through. Timing's off by just a hair, Egon, but we're glad the trap is working again. One more. Just playing. How do you feel? It's pretty good. All extremely weird things considered. So far, just another <clears throat> screwed up day at the office. You know, I never forget a face attached to all the rest of them. I think we met earlier at the Central Hotel. 
You gave me the sideshow chicken drop. My name's Alyssa, Dr. Alyssa Selwyn. And I am Dr. Peter Franklin. And let's see, um, the <coughs> Ray, most of uh, the human. Uh huh, the Ghostbusters. Have you ever been involved in this type of quantum temporal rift event before? A quantum what? It's called arcing, a large pulse of psychic energy. Actually, yes. I was at the museum. A pulse of blue light surged through the building, and then I was standing outside a room on the 13th floor of an old hotel. The Sedgwick. The Sedgwick doesn't have a 13th floor. It was pulling me like a magnet. I felt as though I was in a deep dream. I came to and ran over here. Here? It's a temporary office while I'm in town. I came to do some research after I woke up. We'd like you to come to our lab so we can run some brief tests and ask you more questions. Here's an easy one. Would you like to go out for Thai, Mexican, Japanese? Wow, Dr. Venkman. That time you almost went 45 seconds without saying something abrasive. Want to try for a whole minute next time? A doctor and a fiery one, too. Charming. So charming. Damn. There's the dancing toaster. <laughs> Fuck you, playing, Vinkman. the toaster oh there's some of the stuff I picked up like the model thing huh it's pretty cool he's looking at that video game there Before I do that, let me look down below here. Have you savored the exquisite anguish of tortured soul? Ghostbusters, what do you want? We can schedule a visit um, next Thursday, sometime between 8 a.m. and 4 p.m. You fat fuck. I'm afraid that's the soonest opening. Yeah. Alright, I've got you down for then. Oh, it won't be necessary anymore. That'll be gone. Goodbye. Oh, there's that phone, the pit. Red phone, wow. Where the hell is it? What are you glowing for? Oh, there's the Stay Puff doll. Cutting toilet paper. Let's get to it. Get to it. So you know so much about Gozer because... Because I'm a specialist in ancient Mesopotamian cultures and architecture. <laughs> Sumerian primarily. Gozerian more specifically. I'm here as a guest curator for the Gozerian exhibit that's opening tomorrow at the Natural History Museum. You are aware that we also have some history with Gozer. Yes, of course. Gozer was a bush leader before he met us. A strictly farm themed deity. We put him on the map. But our getting stiffed on invites to opening night, just an oversight, right? I don't have anything to do with that. That, gentlemen, <laughs> is all me. And Mother I can fuck. assure you, it was not an oversight. Dickless. Oh, by the way, you have visitors. Thanks, Janine. Your first class lookout. Dickless. Walter Peck. I did not recognize you without the mayor's backside against your nose. Okay, everybody put them back in their stimmies. 
Apologies. Uh, Dr. Selwyn, are you all right? And Bill Murray's brother. I think brother. so. But I'm worried about the exhibit. Are you kidding? You can't buy publicity like this. The guest curator of the Gozer exhibit, the expert Peck recommended, is attacked the night before the opening by Gozer himself. Please tell me that was Gozer. Gozer manifested in a familiar form, one he had used before, the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, but this event was weaker than his first encounter with us. Ha! That's all I need! Thanks! Come on, Josh. What's the idea of bringing Pratt around here? Oh, have I coughed at the wrong time? <clears throat> Listen, here's the deal. You and Peck and all you guys are going to work together. What? No way, no how. Impossible. Look, this city has given you at least a dozen contracts for the jails, courthouses, and wharves. You guys want to grow your business. Get some county and state work, too. I'm all for it. You've been big supporters and great for my campaign. Well, some have said our endorsement is what got you elected. But not out loud. Anyway, after all the damage you've been causing lately, the city council wants you under close supervision for a period of no less than six months. We filed reports on time. There's no need for extra supervision. <laughs> Funny guy, Bankman. You've always been my favorite. Well, that's why your old friend Pet comes in. He's annoying, a stickler for the rules. In other words, the perfect Pet for the job. He's our new head of Peacock. Peacock? P-C-O-C. Paranormal Contracts Oversight Commission. And my first official act is going to be suspending you clown's operating license. Lighten up, Pet. Launch your investigation if you have to, but for now, just keep them under control and my office in the loop. But remember, if the Ghostbusters cease to exist, so does your job. So you need each other. Beautiful in an ironic, symmetrical kind of way, isn't it? Hey, Mulligan, come on. It's Mayor Mulligan to you, Bankman. So, we have an understanding? This kind of protects us all. You want more government business, I want to keep my approval rating, and Peck wants his little fiefdom. You play by the rules. Easy. We all get what we want, and the city council gets what they need. Okay, big night tomorrow, Alyssa. Get some rest. So, now that we're all friends, can we get invites to the museum opening? If not, likely. But I'll be seeing you soon. You can count on this. Remember, pick. Pick, 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 pick. Doesn't pack look exactly like the kind of guy who accidentally walk into the stream of a boson glider? I'm just saying, it, it could happen. Yeah, it could. <coughs> See, was there anything here? Jesus. <coughs> well, I'm going to end it here, but before then, let's let's oh, look at. Squeaking by, doing the bare minimum once again. What are you doing, pacing yourself? Who the fuck was that? You have twelve <coughs> new messages. Is this Ghostbusters? I'm trying to get some sleep over here, but it's non-stop with all the screaming and moaning and opera singing and things flying around, throwing rocks. Am I the only one in the city that has to get up for work tomorrow? Keep it down! I think some of these are Bill Murray, too. I swear. You have some of them. 11 new messages. <clears throat> yes! What you feed the ghost? I have blue one. It's nice. Want to keep it? Make two tricks. Maybe fetch vodka. It's okay, no? Yeah, that's, that's definitely PC. You have ten new messages. So last night I come back from getting a cup of coffee and find my truck upside down in the middle of Times Square. I know you're saving the city and all, but you think you could just take it a little easier? Sure, when it kills you, then I'll take it easy when I'm pissing on your grave. You have nine new messages. Fuck. Marie 
Any Hanrahan with Comcorp Corp. Stay puffed marshmallows are one of the many high quality products we make here at Comcorp. Frankly, we're outraged. You may have fooled the city with your little puppet show, but not us. This company has worked for over 75 years to cultivate the family friendly image of Mr. Stay Puffed. He was modeled after somebody's uncle for crying out loud, and it wasn't all so you could go to war with him in downtown Manhattan. This is defamation of character on the grandest scale. You'll be hearing from us, Ghostbusters. Have a sunny, funny Comcorp Corp day. Fuck you. You have eight new messages. Yeah, I was wondering, is it safe to eat all this marshmallow goop that's covering my balcony? And... As a follow-up question, what if I already did? Then I hope it's like the stuff Larry Cohen die. You have seven new messages. Yeah, this is Haim Rodriguez. I just wanted to thank you guys for breaking up my kids' bar mitzvah. That was great. Cost me over 50 grand for what? A busted up ballroom and a hotel manager that won't stop crying. Fantastic. It's all good. We just wait for my precious son to become a man for the second time. How does that sound? We'll just wait it out. Or, you know, he'll probably be getting married in eight years or so, so maybe you can come and destroy the wedding, too. Or, or, or maybe his son's Brits. Uh, would you like to attend the blessed occasion with your lasers and your hollering? We look forward to it. Invitations will be in the mail. You're welcome. Of course, I try to let the ghost pick you tear up and slam on his fucking head. You have six fucking bitch. new messages. Oh man, I just saw you guys on TV. Man, that marshmallow dude was all like, blah, and blah, and you guys were like, all like, not my city, that was for you. And people were all like, ah, <laughs> oh man, you guys are awesome. So, like, how's it going? Fucking fruit cake. You have five new messages. Really? Hello, this is Gray Hannert with Hannert and Hannert Attorneys at Law. I'm calling regarding the incident in which one of you opened fire on my client at the Central Hotel earlier this evening. It's really a shame. We've never seen such extensive soft tissue damage. Perhaps we can work something out. Call me back at your earliest convenience. Who the fuck are you talking about? You have four You're shooting buddy. messages. Living buddy. This is Bill at Trotter over at Deluxe Chocolates. And I suppose you guys would know if there was the possibility of you fighting a graham cracker monster in the near future. Okay, because if so, uh, perhaps we could work a deal where Stay Puffed could just be captured and uh, not destroyed. Hey. You know, if you want to eat some goo, I got some right here between my legs, you fucking asshole. White and milky. Three new messages. Dr. Bateman, you know who. I think I somehow left a pair of earrings at your place. And my shoes. Maybe my cat. At a really great time. Call me. What you bring your cat over? You have two new messages. Hey, Ghostbusters, Ron Frenmel out in sunny California. Do you guys have an agent yet? Hey, let me rephrase. I've been talking to the studios, and I sort of let it slip that I'm representing you. There's big interest in a summer tent bowl out here. I am smell a bidding war. Give me a call. You have one new messages. Yeah, hi. My house keeps telling me to get out. You think it means permanently or just, like, for the weekend? It means get out of my face. You have no new messages. Let's start this and then the next time we'll be...
ready. Ray and I have been talking, and we think we should have a look at the museum. Whatever happened tonight, it started there. Okay, I'll take one for the team. Stay with us. You guys go with Winston and the, the crew. I'll be your personal protection. What about Peck? He's supposed to be informed of everything we do. What he doesn't know can't hurt us. Yeah, of course. Hey guys, you need to make a detour. Something big is going down. It's on 10 10 winds now. Tune it in. And another ghostly sighting has staff at the New York Public Library scrambling for answers. Rain lady. Let's get her for real. <laughs> It's been there for 104 years. Where's it going to go today? Uh, this thing you guys have for the crazy lady boards on the street. You know this, right? She made us look like schmucks. Not this time. Oh, and another thing. Pat calls and says that I'm required to tell him where you are and what you are up to. Tell him you can meet us at the museum. We'll be there. Great. That looks familiar. Big crowd. Bankman would love this. Captain McMahon from the 12th says there was a massive disturbance. Real fireworks show. Not much going on now. Maybe. But didn't there used to be two lines out here? Check for valences. Hmm. Interesting. Ray, look at this. Wow, big spikes. Take it out. You need to see this. Stand back. Look out. There they go. Oh, double full torso animators. Come on. After them. You heard stance. Let's move. Great. There they are. A couple of class five animators. Never seen them in tandem like that. They're really agitated. Switching on the pad. Well, let's wait. I'm going to look at some real quick before I end this part. See, was there anything here? Anything over here? Let's chase him down. Winston, check that next doorway. See if he has any friends. Leave a haunted room. I've got no problem with that. Hey, Cadet. To use the shock blaster, it's best to get in fairly close. Its effects are powerful, but dissipate quickly over distance. No, please be careful. It's a prototype. We're trusting you with it. A what? The stasis stream will temporarily slow down paranormal entities. If you train the stream on the target long enough, you can actually stop it entirely. This is how you use it. L2, the stasis. This has nothing to do with cold, but the effect is I've been conducting an experiment in which I sleep an average 14 minutes a day. It leaves me a lot of time to work. Great. Ready to roll. Hey, Haas, you think you can handle that little fella yourself? We'll meet you back here. So this is the one they use, I guess?
So the stasis string, like what the fuck really is it? Shot blast fires a high powered blast of dark matter particles. It's a very powerful close range device, much less effective with distance. Slows and ultimately immobilizes ghosts and other paranormal activities. Stasis stream will fire as long as you want or until the proton pad overheats. Okay. So, how do you get a blast stream recoil decrease? Shot blast increased. Rate of fire increased. Do shall we heat? I don't know if I should. Guess. Might as well get that. I'll save that. Go on, kid, get him. Oh, I got you. That's fucking great. I have an idea. Where the fuck are we doing? Where the fuck did you guys go? Well, I guess this will be a little bit longer. I didn't, wasn't planning on it, but fuck it. I'll see where this goes. Shit. Stay alert. Keep your PK meter up. Animators can hide in anything. Hey, I'll bleach your shot around the corner. Great. Fantastic. Look, it's the cadet. Strong emanations, no direct source though. We followed our guy in here, gave us the slip. Detecting a very strong anomaly here. Yeah, I bet. Uh oh, here comes something big. Shit, shit, shit. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, I knew there was something. Who are you? Library Special Collections was murdered by her lover, philologist Edmund Hoover, when she denied him further access to Special Collections. Hoover was later revealed as an incorrigible serial killer and was executed by the state. Twitty is memor memorialized as a dedicated librarian the day of her life protecting the books she so dearly loved. Portrait of Eleanor Twitty. That fucking slowing down thing sucks. It really does. I don't like... Like this book? No. I'm not sure if I like this thing. Kind of like this is what they want me to use. It's a little bit different, but I'm not sure if I really am a fan of it. Shut up again, that witch! Well, I wanted to take a picture of it, but fuck it. Out and try to be quiet. Great. Oh wow, a full stabilizing levitation. They were close to something. Ray. You got something? Oh shit. I've got something right here. Kid, check that out. Check what out. Ah! She keeps shushing us. That's her, the gray lady. She's the first ghost we ever hunted. Man, I wish Beckman was here. I'm pretty sure Beckman doesn't. Easy now. She's real skittish. Let's go. We'll cut her off. These readings are off the charts. No, that's the charts. Right, now what? What the fuck? Wow! Now listen, this place is reading like a psychic pressure cooker. I'm your thrower. Everybody's too close to the other. What was that? Here, this way, quick. Great. Okay, so Shit. let's stick together. New plan is fan out. Let's have a little approach right here. There are two hostile spirits roaming around in here. Two that we know about. What the? God. I'm away. Shit. 
Temperature's dropping. Event imminent. Brace yourselves. What the fuck? Track me in, motherfucker. Shit. Guys, come to the periodical archives looking at a stack of old newspaper clippings all about some nut named Edmund Hoover, a.k.a. The Collector. Come on, this dude has a history you should know about. He was a rare book collector who seduced Eleanor Quinney, the head librarian of the A gray lady? That would be my guess. What the fuck? Son of a bitch. I don't know which one I'm supposed to go, this way or this way? What the hell is this way? The one is the exit, but what the hell is over here? Anything? Is this the one? Oh, this is the way it went, it came from. That's right. So it went this way. Then this way, because I was confused. Celebrated novelist Arthur Houston conceived and conducted research for his new books at his library table under this lamp for over 60 years. Severe writer's block gripped him in the 60s and one let go. Houston's psychic frustration channeled to the lamp and resides there now, refusing to let anyone read under its light. 1,000. Might as well. Shit! Yeah, it's definitely faster. Son of a bitch. Fuck your books. Come away. Fucking. Employee of the month, great. Yeah, I can't step in this. Yeah, let's get out of here. What the hell is that? I took plasma residue. I thought I had that. Areas of paranormal at, at paranormal content and interaction while some ectoplasm can be seen with the naked eye. Ectoplasm residue can only be seen while using the PTAE meter enhanced paradoggles. Alright. 
Okay, so, guys, it's dead up here. The good kind, I mean. Oh, we may need to get back to you on that. Yeah, we... Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm away. I like that. You just call her slug. There's the big fish. See what he did? Give him a new home and our containment facility. Oh, man. Throw your trap rock. Um, I forgot what. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm awake. Right. Come on. Ones. They'll really appreciate them. Mark, careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Keep moving, sport. We sure don't want to be dropped in here. You all right? Whoa. I'm trying. Find the paper cuts. Where are you? Get your ass up. Thank you. 
fudge. So you get a beat on it. Shit. Do I do some ray or what? This is really useful. Where the hell are you? Thanks for the warning, Ray. But I have no idea what you're talking about. You may want to just take our word for it. <sighs> the hell is these things? Drawn to old libraries and archives, these malicious apparitions have been known to clothe their insubstantial forms with paper, books, tomes, parchments, and even ancient scrolls in order to manifest them and interact with the mortal world. Paper constructs seem to be lesser manifestations that are controlled by more powerful entities. If only print was dead. The print was dead. 7,000. So I got Blast Stream. Oh, yeah. 